What's up, YouTuber? This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. So I'm doing another fan request. Galaxy S8 Plus, right? 2017 flagship from Samsung, right? 12 megapixel camera, right? But what about 2015 flagship? The Galaxy S6 Edge Plus, right? You could pick this phone up 250 to 300 bucks, right? For cheap. This phone also has a 16 megapixel camera. So let's go ahead and put these two head to head and see which one of King Supreme. Now, you could pick the Galaxy S8 Plus uh, mid 700 to 800 bucks. But yes, you could pick up the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus for cheap, right? There it is. And uh, look at that. All the components in there, nice. Just beautiful. For 250 bucks, wow. So can the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus come close to the Galaxy S8 when it comes down to the cameras, right? Both of these devices, again, is running Android 7.0. So let me go ahead and boot this up and let y'all guys see the camera app between both of these devices. All right, so I got the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus. Uh, I got that up and running. All my information is in it, right? And let me show you guys something here. Um, and this is going to shock you guys, right? Let's go to about phone. Uh, remember 2015 device here, right? Uh, let's see. This phone is running Android 7.0 with January security patch, right? This is the Galaxy S8 Plus. 2017 flagship. Let's go to go to settings and let's go to look at about phone and let y'all guys see what this device is running. It's Android 7.0, right? December of 2017 security patches. <laughs> so the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus 2015 device is running the latest security patch versus uh, the Galaxy S8 Plus. So let's go to do the full review of what both of these cameras in action. So get your popcorn ready. This is going to be a good one. And follow me on this journey. Let's go. All right, guys, so this is 1080p, 30 frames per second between the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus 2015 flagship and the Galaxy S8 Plus, right? And so let's get into it. 30 frames per second on both of these devices. Look at that, 2015 flagship. Nice. Look at that color. Get into it, kind of go around there. One of my favorite phones of all times, actually, as far as design-wise, functionality, is the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus. This is a gorgeous, beautiful, well-built device. Uh, piece of jewelry, I may say, right? So let's get into it. All right, let's look at the details there. Look at the details on both devices. Yes, look at that. Let's look at the sky. Kind of overcast sky today. We did a lot of raining earlier. So it's no sun today. So it's kind of medium type lighting. Let's go to our tree. Now let's look at the focus points at uh, 30 frames per second. Let's go here, focus, here. All right, and you be the judge for yourself which device have the better image. And I'm gonna go audio from side to side so y'all guys can hear both devices in action. All right, so let me go down and switch to 1080p, 60 frames per second on both of these devices. So here we go, 1080p, 60 frames per second on the Galaxy S8 Plus and the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus. Now on the Galaxy S8 Plus, you only limit it to 10 minutes of recording at 1080p at 60 frames per second. But the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus is no limit. Right? And you we all know uh, that the Galaxy device has been plagued with focusing issues, but I've been seeing some recent updates, right? And let's see if it fixed the problem. Look at that. You be the judge for yourself. Look at that. Which one has a better camera? Go in there. 
Look at the details. All right. So look at that. Look at the sky. All right. Let's go to the tree. Let's look at some focusing points. Real close. Let's get out a little bit. Let's go here. All right. Here. Now, the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus is a device that will set you back about 250 to 300 bucks. And it's running Android 7.0 uh, uh, January 2018 security patch. Uh, <laughs> which is this awesome on its own, right? So look at that. You be the judge for yourself for looking at both of these cameras. Optical image stabilization on both of them. Yes. So let's go here real deep. And again, I'm going to go audio from side to side, but I want y'all guys to see that. Look at that plant. Look how beautiful that is. 16 megapixel versus 12 megapixel. Look at that. And yeah, I do see the focus of issues on the Galaxy S8. This this crazy, man. How could how could a 2015 phone and it, I guess they've seen this share of updates too. Uh, it's it's kind of focusing issues is fixed compared to the Galaxy S8, man. All right, so that's 1080p, 60 frames per second on both of these devices. Now look at that. Ah, let's go to the switch to 4K on both of these devices. All right, so we are in 4K with both devices, the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus and the Galaxy S8. All right, so we got on the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus at 4K, you limit it to five minutes recording. Uh, the Galaxy S8 Plus, you limit it to 10 minutes recording. All right, so let's get into some details here. Look at that, look how beautiful that is. Now we got a lot of wind blowing, uh, which is fine. We're gonna go ahead on and see what it's all about. See that? See, now the cameras have to focus a little harder because you got the plants moving, which is a good thing. I love to see this. All right, we're doing this at 4K. Check it out. Okay, and let's do some focusing. All right. Boom. Yes. That is nice. Go up in the sky. That is. So this is 4K on the Galaxy S8 Plus and uh, the uh, Galaxy S6 Edge Plus. All right, so I got both devices on a tripod and we go check out the zooming in and zooming out on both devices, right? I'm shooting this at 1080p, 30 frames per second. So let's go on and zoom in on both devices and let y'all guys see how I look, the quality. So I'm gonna zoom in the Galaxy S8 Plus first and that's eight times zoom. I want you to look at that, the garbage can there. And let's go on to do with the Galaxy S8 six edge plus let's zoom it all the way in all right and again eight times zoom remember that both devices have the same camera app so nothing changed so you be the judge for yourself when you look at that both devices completely zoomed in fairly decent lighting on the outside so look at that yes let's zoom out on the galaxy s8 plus all right, and let's zoom out on the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus. All right, and look at that. All right, let's go ahead and change the focus on something a little more colorful. We got a sign right there. We're gonna take both devices and put it on that sign right there. And let's go ahead and zoom in so y'all guys can read that sign. And eight times zoom that in. Look at that, go up a little bit. All right. So that is the Galaxy S8 Plus. Let's go on the zoom in on the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus so y'all can read that sign. And that is eight times zoom. Let's look at that. All right, see if I can get that right in the center. Boom. All right, so look at that. Look at the quality on both devices and you be the judge for yourself. So that is zoom in and zoom out on the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus and the Galaxy S8 Plus. 
right, so this is the front facing cameras of the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus and the Galaxy S8 Plus, right? An 8 megapixel camera on the Galaxy S8 Plus and a 5 megapixel camera on the Galaxy S6 Edge Plus, right? So look at that, look at the clarity there, right? Let's go look at the background and let y'all guys see some of the background there, right? Which camera give you the best color? Which one is better? And again, I'm gonna go audio from side to side, but let's look at that plant, kind of give y'all guys a good representation on how the front facing camera will look. Look at that. It's beautiful. Just beautiful. And you be the judge for yourself. $250 to $300 phone compared to $800 phone. Wow. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about both of these devices in action. See you guys on the next video. Peace.